a Swansea City career mode since people have voted for that. Swansea got two votes, well, a million from Edward, <laughs> but I'll count that as one, and then one from Fortnite Gaming HD, which is Mason Shitty, also looks like SpongeBob, and then Colon got, Colon got one vote, and that was from that Chelsea Forever guy, who was in the stream. Don't know why he doesn't want me to do a Chelsea career mode, but. Anyway, let's let's just <laughs> But let's do a Swansea career mode since that's had two to one votes over Cologne. So Swan I think Swansea could actually be a good team to do. And Mason I'm doing this every I'm doing this career mode every Thursday because I'm got I've actually made up a timetable of what I'm gonna do instead of just doing career mode every single fucking day. <laughs> there we go. There we go. It's unprofessional. It's unprofessional. <laughs> We're on our way. We're on our way. To the back, uh, we're on our way. I'll tell you what I've got done, Mason, or did you hear it in my stream? Thursday's gonna be career mode of fans' choice plus squad battles and like SBCs, whatever I want to do. Friday will be dev rivals and squad battles. Fortnite will be Fortnite will be Saturday. No, Saturday will be Fortnite and squad battles because I'm wanting to do squad battles every day so I can get a high a high rank. Then Sunday's just the same as Saturday, Fortnite and squad battles. Then Monday is playing viewers on Ultimate Team. Tuesday is playing pro. Yeah, Tuesday is playing pro clubs. With subscribers, and then Wednesdays playing Fortnite with subscribers. <coughs> Fuck the Leicester career mode. Swansea's here to stay. Swansea. So Swansea it is. Yes, it is. Chelsea forever. Because that's had two votes to one. Because you voted for Cologne. And Edward and Mason voted. For Swansea, Swansea used to have Neil Taylor. Swansea used to have Ashley Williams and Neil Taylor. <laughs> no, who do they have? Well, their team's fucked up because they're playing. They don't even have any good players. Fulton and Grimes, I'm going with. They've still got Wayne Routledge, fuck's sake. Who's younger? Uh, Dyer's, Dyer's younger. Aye. Dunno. So th this Roberts will be my starting right back because he's younger. He's young and he's 70 rated, so I could train him up to be a good player. Carter Vickers, I would need to actually get a new centre back for him in the second season because he's only on loan to Swansea. Uh, Carter Vickers. Sanchez on loan, you want about Renato Sanchez? He wants me to bring back Renato Sanchez again. <laughs> oh, you got detention? <laughs> what have you got detention for? How what happened that you got detention? <laughs> Why well, were you standing on the table and singing? Ferlan Mindy, he's a left back who used to play for fucking Re uh, Olympic Leon. 
do you not think I already know that? Tyler Reed will go out on loan. Roberts is going to stay here because he's going to be my starting right back. Valverde's very versatile. I'll probably sign, I'll sign him then. I need a new cent. I need a new centre back, which is over 70 rated because I've got two fucking centre backs that aren't very good. I've got these two guys, but they're both young, so I could easily train them till they're over 70. So I don't actually need defenders over 70. Half of, half of this team is old. Declan John, he used to play for Rangers. Saliba, not sure if you can get him, but maybe. Oh, William Saliba, he's actually a decent player. Byers will get rid of him. Leroy Fair. He's been... He's been at... He's been at like Swansea for like ten se ten years, so I don't know whether I should keep him and make him be a club legend or whether I should just get rid of him. Um, Leroy Fair, twenty eight. He's been at a club for. Get rid of Fair. Told me to get rid of him. Matt Grimes, I'll send him out on loan. Andy King, Adam King, he's Scottish. Marlang Sar. Wait, I'll have Tom Carroll as my starting. I need, I need centre backs. Uh, Edward. Bersant Selenia is supposed to be a good player. Narsing, we'll get rid of him. McBurney, we're keeping him just because he's Scottish and I'm Scottish. Botty Biabi doesn't even sound like a Scottish name. So you guys are telling me to go in for... Dar Dario what? This guy Dario... What, you want me to go in for Dario Marisic? Marlang Sar? Marling Sar William Saliba I need Aye. Drew, see when you just came in and said Mum 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 I thought you were in a fight or something. Yeah. Is it because there was somebody at the door? <laughs> so let's scout this guy. Right, so suggest me suggest me some left backs which is under fourteen million because I need a new left back as well. And a new right back. No. A new striker because I've only got one striker. So Matt Target, let's go with him. Oh, let's stick, let's stick him on shortlist, doesn't mean I'm going to get him. So, left back, Mark, Matt Target. I need a new striker. Another striker for under 14 million. They want me to, they want me to try and... Fight for promotion. I don't think that's gonna work because how else was he gonna get promoted in the first season with a team like this? Chelsea forever is Maris. It's gonna be a good player because I, because I've never, I've never actually used them. A guy called Dario Marisic. Jonathan David oh. 
Maris at just seventy two rated. Is that what he can is that what he can get up to? Or is that what he starts as? Don't know how to spell Jonathan, so I'm just gonna have to go to the Belgian Pro League. The Belgian Pro League. Oh, so that's what he starts as, 72 rated. That's actually decent. Is it KA Gent or RC Genk? I don't even know. I'll try this one. Here he is, Jonathan David. Hi Tiny Jasper, welcome to my stream. Wait, so I've got three centre backs to choose from. One left back, one striker. Guys, I also need you to tell me a new, a new right mid. Because I'm getting rid of all three of these right mids because they're all old. So, if you can suggest me a young, a young right mid for under 14 million. A Muzu. David Martin, I thought he was playing for fucking New uh, West Ham. Amuzu, and tell me young CDMs as well, Chelsea forever. Wait, Amuzu, that I've I've actually used him before, and he's a decent player. Francis Amuzu, can he play on both left and right, or can he just play left? <laughs> yes, right mid also. So I need two young CDMs, well possibly one. Cause Jay Fulton's 24. Give me, suggest me one young CDM. Cause Jay Fulton's 24, so I'm gonna keep him. And a young Cam as well. Everyone subscribe to me, Tiny Jasper. No self-promoting in the chat, please. Right, so Chelsea Forever, I need a new CDM who's under 14 mil and a new Cam who's under 14 mil. Right wing Chong. I don't like Tadif Chong that much. Oh, and a Muzu. Could I loan him? No. Erwin, what? Erwin Mulder, I how? Cam go for Gomez from Mum United. <laughs> I'll go. I'll go. Give me a new right mid because that Amuzu guy's not. That Amuzu guy's recently joined. Angel Gomez, I need. Angel Gomez. This wee guy who from Mum United, Angel Gomez. Can anyone suggest me a new right mid and a new CDM? Rocker for CDM. Who's Rocker? He better not be that fucking big fat guy if he fucking severe. Mark Rocker. Oh, it's this guy. He looks like a decent player. And then I need a right mid because Umuzu has recently joined and elect. Should I go with this guy for right mid? 
Alex Sally Merkels or Markles, whatever his name is. Alex is Sally Markles. Alexis Sally Markles. Should I go with him? Right mid or left mid Hudson or Doy? You I think he'll cost too much. Edward So you're gonna have to suggest someone under fourteen million. Ito, he plays left mid. Tatsuya, Tatsuya Ito plays left mid. Right mid also. Right, so I've, I've got a good selection of players now. On catalogue, get financial takeover. My next financial takeover is at level 25. So I've got a good selection of players here. I've got... I'm gonna wait till they get scouted and then actually find out how much they want for them. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna simulate. Should I simulate the final of this tournament if I get to it, or should I play the final? Kyle Norton. Right, so there's two transfer offers. One for Kyle Norton for Fulham for three mil. And one for Todd Carroll to go to Victoria Gomareri's for 3.3. .3. Should I accept any of them? Or should I negotiate? Don't sell Carroll, okay. So, don't sell him. Should I sell Kyle Notting to Fulham? For 3 mil. He, he looks like a... That would, that would possibly be a realistic signing anyway. Kyle Notting to Fulham. Three mil, so Kyle Notting now plays for Fulham. Negotiate, you just told me to sell him and then you told me to negotiate. Right, so should I get rid of Michael van der Hoorn to Nuremberg for 2.9 million? I'm gonna negotiate, negotiate, try and get five mil. Edward, I don't think I'll get five mil, but I'll try. Right, Nuremberg, if you have got five million, can you please give me it? Five mil for Van der Hoorn. Two point nine. Minimum four million. Four point three. Three point six. Four point one. Looks like Nuremberg don't want them because they've their boss just rejected 4.1. Can you scout Kangin Lee? I don't like that guy, Kangin Lee. I've used him before. Where can he play centre mid? Well, I'm not playing a centre mid position, so how's he gonna fit? <laughs> He's young, he's young, he's young, the two defenders, the two CDMs are young, and the centre back's young, and the right back, so half of the team's young, half of the team's old. And this guy called Rod Rodon is young, I'll probably keep him, 
for a backup centre back just in case the two new centre backs that I get get injured. King and Lee, like. Kangin Lee, I'll scout him. 15 million for him? No, are we? Yeah. How'd you know? <laughs> Hello, boat boy. What a name. Welcome to the stream. If you're new, sub subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you can join my stream every time I live stream. Loan bait, loan offer for Baker. I don't need him, so I'm gonna let him go out on loan. McBurney, I'm keeping him. Should I, should I get rid of Leroy? I am subbed. Thank you for the subscriber. One new subscriber so far, guys. Let's try and make that more. Should I sell Leroy Fair? Or should I keep him? Because he is our club legend. He's been here for about seven seasons. We didn't even know he used to play for QPR. Keep him. So we'll keep him. We'll keep McBurney as well, just because he's young and he's got good potential. Kyle Notting has sold, but Cooper will get rid of him, cause he has no face and he's 60 rated, and I don't like using players in this game that don't have a face. We're facing Real Av FC. Let's see if we can beat them. They've got a shit lineup. The only team, I, the only person I know from this team, would be Samedu and Contral. Fabio Contral used to play for Real Madrid, and that Samedu is Nelson Samedu's brother, the one who plays for Barcelona. We just beat them three 0 but then our Cam gets injured. What? What is rubbish? So we would need to find, we would need to put Tom Carroll there. Until he gets uninjured. Wait, Cam situation solved, Valverde can play at Cam and get him, for, get him on a loan. I, I could get Valverde on a loan, would he join but if I tried to loan him? I don't think he would. I thought you wanted me to get Angel Gomez at Cam. Or these two guys. Obringoli, can't get him. Kangin Lee. But we'll try, we'll try and loan out Valverde. Uh, this one, Valverde. Approached by Brighton. We need to try and stop Brighton from getting him. We can loan Valverde in, yay. <laughs> well, I'm going... I'm going, that's not even a word. I'm going to loan him for one season, guys. Because any, if I try to loan him for two seasons, they always reject it. And they'll say, oh, he cannot join at this moment in time. Please come back later. So we're going to sim against Frozenone. What a, what a name for a team, Frozenone. Valverde has rejected the loan move. Looks like he doesn't want to join. Looks like he doesn't want to come to Wales. But that's fine. I've got other players I could use. Fuck you, Valverde. Let's try... So should I try and loan in Angel Gomez? Or just buy him for one million? 
because if I loan them in, then I could train them up, and then by season two comes, I could per sign them permanently. Because that's what you do with young players. You usually loan them to train them, and then train them up to what you want to get them to, and then buy them. Try and loan them. Wait for all scouts. I don't have scouts. One year. Chelsea forever. I don't have any scouts. Lo uh, loaned and uh, scouted out to any country. He'll be more expensive. No, he won't. He? Oh, scout reports. So we're gonna sim this match against Frozy Noni. Oh, what a name. Loan offer for Harry's. We'll loan him out to the Chinese League and we're keeping Jay Fulton. Let's block offers for Jay Fulton because he's not going anywhere. As after a season, he will be higher rated, so more expensive. Edward, when you when they give you the option to sign them on on a permanent from a loan deal, you get them for nothing because they automatically arrive with you for a free deal because you've already had them for your season for one year on a loan, so they you get them for nothing. Angel Gomez has been loaned in, so there's a new cam we have. Roberts isn't going anywhere, reject that. Should I sell Luciano Narsing to the Brazilian League for 2.9 million or should I try and negotiate? See if I can try and get about 4 million out of them. Negotiations for what price? <laughs> Aye. Negotiations for what price? What? Why does it? Why does the fucking Brazilian league manager look like Alex Ferguson? <laughs> he looks like Sir Alex Ferguson. Fuck's sake! Three point nine million. They want three point four. 3.7 is the highest I'm going, mate. Striker Mosey Keen. Mosey Keen, I don't think is any good in the first season. Scout reports came back from Matt Target. He's 71 rated and he's worth 2.7 million. Should I loan Matt Target or should I sign him? Scout reports came back for Jonathan David and Matt Target. He's worth 5 million and Matt Target's worth 3 million it says here. I still need to wait. It says he's worth 5 mil, between 4 and 6 mil. How's he 72 rated? I've never actually heard of this guy before. And Matt Target's got a real face. What about, does anyone else here have a real face apart from Matt Target? Apparently this guy looks like a Down Syndrome. He's bald, so that wouldn't be his real face. Get Brigola, he can also play at Cam. It said he's recently joined from Sassuolo. So I can't sign him. Ito's real face is there then. Kangan Lee doesn't even have a real face. His game face doesn't even look like he's from Korea. So we're going to buy Matt Target for. I'll try and get him cheaper than 3 million, around about 2.5. See if they want 
because I want to try and get him close to his base value as possible. 2.4, 3.5 I'll go, 3 I'll go 2.5 plus 20% sell-on clause, although I'm not even going to sell him. Mate, why would I get Bergola when he's recently joined? 3 million. There we go. 3 mil. Lee can play it right mid also. Oh, that's good. So let's see if we can... Let's see if that comes back from Matt Target. So now we've got Angel Gomez, he's 67 rated, but hopefully once I train him, he'll be higher rated than Bersant Selenia. So then he... He's from Kosovo. Bersant Selenia used to be from like Slovakia or something, now he's from Kosovo apparently. So we're facing Giron Gerondins or Geronians. There we go, all the scout reports are back for all the players. Matt Grimes will go out on loan to Independiente for one season. Hopefully when he comes back he's uh, over the rating of 70, because if he is then I'll start him. He's already 70. Hopefully he's about 75 when he comes back, then I'll start him. Oh, Jerome didn't beat us, man. Fuck off. Guys, the reason I'm asking for young players is so... Well, if I get young players, then that means that they could grow up to be like the best players in the league, and then I could possibly have fun using them. <laughs> Shit, I rejected that by accident. But four million for this guy. I've never actually used this guy in career mode before, so I don't know if he's any good or if he's terrible. Let's do a swap deal, let's do Michael van der Hoorn. Plus two million. There we go. We got we basically got him for two mil. Saliba, we can't even loan him. So we need to wait to second season to try and get him. But my lines are we could possibly go in for him as well. Let's see if I could offer about 9 million for him. His value is 7 mil, so let's see if I can offer 7.5. The same as his offer. They want 10 million for him. How about I drop that down to 8.4? 10.3. What about 9.5 Would that work? 9.5, there we go. 9.5 for a good centre back. And he's only 19. So he could also get better as he goes on as well. Yeah. <laughs> and he's a left back, so if my left back gets injured then he could play there as well. What's wrong with 9 million for a 19 year old? Nordveit wants to go to Cologne. <laughs> the, the team at Chelsea Forever wanted me to do Cologne. One of the Swansea goalkeepers wants to go there. And Grimes also wants to go out to 
Bashakia, which is a Turkish team. I don't even know how to pronounce it, so I might be pronouncing it wrong. I'm not good with pronouncing foreign names. Super califragilisticexpialidocious, you dibba dibba dibba, you are atrocious. Right, so we just wait for Brigola. And how would I be able to say him? He's recently joined Sasabolo. Is there p a possible way I could loan him? Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea Forever. Is there a possible way I could loan him in? Loan in. Enrico Bern. Bring Nola. You have to speak a season, what you on about, mate? Chelsea Forever, can you suggest a goalkeeper for me? Because all these... You have to skip a season. I'm not skipping any season. But can anyone suggest a young goalkeeper for me? Because... Oh, two young goalkeepers... Uh, what... Uh, two young goalkeepers so I can have a substitute. Sevilla, Miles Sevilla, that's actually decent. I'll go with him. I've used Sevilla before so I know... So I know how... What to do and how he's like. Mason, imagine fucking Swansea in the Champions League final. Shit, Svila on loan. Imagine that, Mason. That'd be a good. That would be good. Seeing Swansea in the Champions League final. That's what I'm gonna try and do. I'm gonna try and get Swansea in the Champions League final. So. All the scout offers have... No, I want to sign him because I don't want Aug Augsburg taking him off me. So let's you let's stick the new signings in the starting eleven. There is only one new signing, and that's Marlon Saar. But Mason, fucking this guy's nineteen. He's already seventy-five rated. He's like Donna Rumor. Seven eighteen years old at already eighty two rating for Donna Rumor. <laughs> Should I sign Donna Rumor and Sevilla? Wait, I don't even think I'll have enough money for Donna Rumor. Another centre back. Yes, I've got another centre back. And it's Dario. Dario Marasic, but I didn't even know he was a real player. He's 18 and he's 72 rated. I think that Dario Marasic guy's a hidden gem because I've never even heard of him. But he looks like a decent player to use. There we go, 72 rated centre back at the age of 18 and he's from Austria. So he could, so if we ever come up against Bayern in the Champions League or any cup game, then he can start talking gibberish to uh, fucking David Alba. <laughs> He'll start talking fucking gibberish to him. So there's my two new centre backs. My two young centre backs, which are 72 and 75. Lee for right mid, Kangin Lee. K 
Kangan Lee's recently joined, but I could pay. What? Cannot afford the release clause. How much money am I on? I'm on 8 million. I need to wait till I get 15 mil to afford this release clause. Not very sold, so that's like another 2 million. Or however much it was. Yeah, one, another 1.9 million added to the transfer budget. So, Miles Vilar, 68 rated, but he will be able to get to about 72 this season, hopefully. Kangen Lee for right mid. George Biles. Should I send George Biles out to the Saudi Professional League? Because I won't need him. Don't pay 15 mil for Kangen Lee, then how am I gonna get him? Do you get it together? Mason looks like a big dick. Mason looks like a big dick. We're gonna we're we're shut up, Mason. I did live a life running for my life. I will always hit you. I came in like a wrecking ball. Was that the one you were singing, Mason? Who's shitting or so? <laughs> Why she go na 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 na? She fucking standing on a snake or something. I'm on nine million. Right, Chelsea forever. How could I sign this guy? Zaracho seventy two rated for Cam or right mid. Zaracho. Shit, that's not even the right person. I don't know why I accidentally clicked on him. Zaracho. Matthias Zaracho. He's 20 years old. Shit, he's recently joined Gladbach uh, Leverkusen. Let's see if he's got a fucking release clause, because if he is, I'm paying it. No, he doesn't. Oh, Zaracho's recently moved. Mate, is there. Mate, is there any other person you could suggest for Cam? Oh, Marcus is shit. Oh, Alonso is shit. How dare you, Mason? Oh, Stevie Morrison is old. Oh, Stevie Morrison is old. Wait, mate, I'm gonna... Uh, Chelsea Forever, I'm gonna get this guy for right mid because I already have Declan James for left mid. So if I sign Ito, he'll be going in the right mid position. And I don't need a new cam because I've got Angel Gomez. Mason is so shit. Let's train some of the young players I've signed so far. Striker will be Oliver McBurney, this guy. And Jonathan David. What? But how are you gonna win your next three games when the fucking league's finished? <laughs> I 
Do you do you play or sim games? I play some games and sim ones that I can't, can't be bothered playing. What's the best team you've ever built? What an ultimate team or uh career mode boat boy? <laughs> that a name, boat boy. Vote for boat. Vote for boat boy. Vote for boat boy. <laughs> That's my best English accent. Or oh, career mode. Uh, it would have to be a rain. It would have to be a Rangers one where I sent Jaden Sancho, Donnarumma, uh, Isco. This was like in the tenth season. Isco, Sancho, Vinicius Junior. Isco, fucking Sergio Busquets and things like that. And it was the best team ever. I've done it for like 12 seasons. <laughs> so guys, we're gonna play this game away from home against Sheffield Wednesday. So the players are making their debuts as Daryl Marasic. Sar, Svila, Gomez and Ito, the other players who are making, wait I'm gonna bring Wayne Routledge in at the start and then bring Ito hopefully on as a sub. Do, 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 do. Do 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 do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hopefully, once I get Angel Gomez on that permanently, then he can score against Man United, his old team, which I will laugh at if he does. I will go ha ha ha. And Declan James can score against the team what he's already joined in real life, which is Man United. Declan James, Declan Jones, same fucking thing. Oliver McBurney. David James, that wee fucking black guy who used to play for Liverpool and he had fucking... Specs on, that's Daniel James, I'm on about the one who signed for United. Oliver McBurney. Daniel James, shut up. I know what I meant to say. Why do you have your fucking teeth out wide? Why is my belly out wide? Because I'm fat. <laughs> Guys, I hope I can win against Sheffield United because in real life they're promoted to the Premier League. What difficulty are you playing on? I don't know. Jake, this is Sheffield United's first ever time being in the Prem. Because they're in the Prem with Norwich and whatever else, Aston Villa. I know Aston Villa and Norwich have been in the Prem before, but I've never actually seen Sheffield United in the Prem before. Aston Villa's recently not that long been in the Prem, they were last in the Prem in like 2016 or 17. Marlang Sar making his debut. Oh there's Dario, he just, oh it's Declan John. Declan John, he has a big yawn when he wakes up. <laughs> Declan John, he gives a big yawn. Declan John, he sticks his horn in his arse. <laughs> Leroy Fair, him and his fucking long legs. He's a living legend at this club. Oh shit. Daniel James could have had that there if he crossed it properly. That was almost 1-0 to 
Sheffield United, I forgot their name now. Hogan, Hogan should be playing for them, because he's a decent player. Hogan and fucking Oliver Norwood. He plays for Villa, but he was on loan to uh, Sheffield last season. Oliver... Aye. Aye. Gary's uncle. There's a guy who plays for Sheffield United called Oliver Norwood, and he used to play for Brighton. Or was it Fulham he played for? Don't actually know. But we're one nil down. He's doing the cel he's doing the aeroplane celebration. He's just running up and down like a spaz. Is that Hogan? No, that was Basham who scored. Golasso. I want to do the lack of quitter, but I don't think any one of these players would be able to do that. You hold L1, and then you move the left anal the right analog stick left and right. You move it left if you want to do it left ways. You move it right if you want to do it right ways. Obviously, ah, <laughs> that's out. No, that's a fucking McGiddy spin. Or a bird bus bin. It's either called a bird bus bin or a McGeady spin. Bird bus spin, no burger spin. Burger and chips, and I'll s can you serve it to me when you're spinning a room, please? Welcome to McDonald's, how can I take your order? Can I have burger and chips, and can you serve it to me when you're spinning a room? Oh, that's why we. Cause I would, I would like my order in style. Serve me with, serve me with a swagway while spinning around, please. <laughs> Cause I want a little spin. I'll. <laughs> no, that's a flip flop. Did you see his ass Did you see his ass It looks like. Do you know what the fucking Balassi flick is? Do you know what a fucking uh, flip flap is? It's kind of like that, but you do it differently. Nightbots in my chat. The allies you set this command to be of hashtag sub does not exist. Your mum doesn't exist. Fucking spasms. I'm one nail down. We're wearing orange and black. This basically looks like a fucking old Man United top, but it's orange and black instead of red and black. Yeah. yeah. I know, that's a bit of stupid. What the fucking what the fucking blue one with the red and white lines gone done it? I thought, it was, I thought it was still the one with the white and red lines gone down it. Oliver McBurney tried a long shot, but it... What? What? Right. Yes. Oh well. Oh, Leroy Fair. Cut that on his head. We... Wayne Routledge, I'm bringing on a sub now. So I'm gonna bring on Angel Gomez for Selenia and Ito for Wayne Routledge. Here we go. 
Let's see if Ito and Gomez can perform better. Oliver Norwood. I like the way he fucking says that there. Oliver Norwood. Like he's some type of posh prick. Don't know. After I've streamed this Mason Joint a day prop hunt. Oh, what a save. Svila with a great save though. What could have made it 2-0 if he didn't save it? Angel Gomez, or Jared HD calls him Gooms. <laughs> Don't know. Angel Gomes. Ref. Diego Costa. Angel Gomes. Or should he say Angel Gooms? <laughs> Ang Diego Costa, Angel Di Maria. Yeah. <laughs> why were you dan? Why were you standing on the table singing? What were you singing? Were you singing the Frozen song? <laughs> What one was that? <laughs> Don't sing, you can't sing. <laughs> no, you can't. McGoldick went off. McGoldick McGo sub got subbed off because he's got a golden dick. Eto. Oh, D Daniel James is on the bar. Oh, he, he's now not on the ball. Oh, Svila's make pulling off great saves here. Wait, lads, I will be back.
chub. Lewis Capaldi, can you be quiet, please? <laughs> but <laughs> yeah, was he? How'd you know? What, hey Gazzy? What, walking up to Gaz? Hey Gazzy! <laughs> oh. Gary Medina almost scored. I thought he played for fucking Sheffield Wednesday. Didn't Gary Medina know you used to play for like Bolton or something? Capaldi, can you be quiet, please? Mason, actually, shut up. Cross and. Oh. Shut up. Shut up or get kicked. Your choice. Oh, what a save. Mason, did you hear about the wrestler that died yesterday? Yeah. Scottish wrestler. Don't know, people say it's suicide. And he was, and he was a champion as well, because he was... He was supposed to be fucking... Facing someone for his championship, like today, before he died, but he can't. He can't. He didn't. Uh, yesterday. <laughs> no, they're gonna do like a tournament or something to see who'll be the next champion. Yeah, because he's from Glasgow. He's from Air, but he died in Glasgow. Because the wrestling companies, the wrestling companies in Glasgow. No, that's the WWE. No fucking the wrestling he works at. Right guys, Naki Wells, Wills, he's a shit player, he used to, didn't he know he used to be English and then he changed. Right guys, so I'm gonna end this episode off right here. So I'll be back next Thursday with episode 2. If I can even remember. <laughs> Peace out, guys. <laughs>